What's up gamers, it's your boy Domain. <laughs> we're, we're here today to just have a quick breakdown of Black Friday because I did this last year, I want to do it again, I want to make sure you guys get the best deals. I scoured the internet for a good like 30-40 minutes to find the best, in my opinion, deals from Black Friday. And I also included some stuff in here that's not necessarily Black Friday, it's just really good deals. I'm gonna start with Amazon, work my way through all of the, uh, the big capitalist companies in America. <laughs> So we're going to start with Amazon. Uh, they've actually got a surprisingly large amount of Black Friday deals. I wanted to start by showing you Amazon Warehouse, though. A lot of people don't know that Amazon Warehouse is actually a super cheap way to get uh, Halo products. All you need to do is click Amazon Warehouse from this drop-down menu, then click Halo or type Halo, and you get return deals. So these are things that have been returned to Amazon, and usually they're completely fine. I bought a Jager Adumni recently that had a broken heel, which was a shame, but a lot of the time it's it's just like damaged packaging people have returned or maybe they just didn't want it anymore. So we got a Mantis for 20, a Jazzwear Helmet 57, the Ghost of Requiem for 11. I've actually bought this twice on Amazon uh, Warehouse. It's such a good deal. Yeah, the uh, 117 Mouse, uh, $41, $14 for Chopper Takedown. Sometimes you have to scroll a lot. There's the Jager Adumni, $30 is very good. Uh, even the World of Halo Flood for $20. So make sure to check out Amazon Warehouse. It's always a good deal. Now let's talk about the specific deals here. We've got the Mongoose with Chief for only $9. Like that's actually ex an exceptional price, right? Like $9 from uh, 25. I'm gonna be buying this. I'm gonna be adding this to cart after this video because I don't have that Mongoose and it's it's $9, guys. It's $9. It's, a lot of people, uh, you know, they think Jazzware prices are a little intimidating to get into, but I've started collecting and now I just can't stop. They are so good. So uh, we got the Mongoose. We got the three pack with elite mercenary or warlord and two uh, grunt conscripts. They're the same grunt with the same needle, but they're nice for army building. And that elite, I can vouch, is a very nice one. He also came in the banished ghost. Very nice. Uh, we've also got a, oh, a heroes and villains. Oh, that's $30. Yeah, so reduced to 16 for three figures. Very good price. Then we've got the, uh, now this one's a bit confusing. I've wanted one of these checkpoints for a while, so I will be picking one of these up, but I don't know what it is because it's got a picture of a monkey and a Spartan, but it says uh, mission penance with elite warlord and jackal freebooter. So I don't know. I don't know if it is actually one of these armory packs. This is the banished checkpoint and comes with a load of banished weapons. So I would hope it was this one, but at the same time, this uh, mission penance is probably quite good. Uh, I don't know which one that actually is. Let's have a look. Um, uh, maybe there's actually no images for it. <laughs> oh, it just shows the images of the brute and the- what? <laughs> so m maybe this doesn't even exist. So the fact that I can't actually find it online makes me think that it will actually be the banished checkpoint. So, uh, go and pick that up. $17 is awesome, especially for the armory. Then we've got the three marine pack for $17. Another excellent price. And these are all Black Friday deals. Uh, yeah, you know, yeah, I don't really like to support Amazon, but I mean, they have the best Halo <laughs> a lot of the time. Uh, we got the Art of Halo hardcover copy book for $18. Apparently, apparently this is a lightning deal, so you have to, like, there's a percentage of people that can claim it within eight hours. That's awesome. Then these two caps. We've got a unisex ball cap, or unsex <laughs> ball cap. $13 is great. That's a Black Friday deal. And this green one. I would never personally have a Master Chief helmet uh, in my apparel, but I mean, it's it's nice. Helmet, hat, whatever. <laughs> but uh, this one is, I would actually have, like, I, I'm, I'm very tempted to add this to cart. That is a very nice, uh, yeah, embroidered Ooh, third, I think I might. Mm, I, I, I gotta I gotta be careful with my spending. I might get the uh, mongoose and the baseball cap. I think that, that this one, yeah, the mongoose and the cap might be a good good purchases. Thirteen dollars for a cap is is decent, and it looks very high quality. Uh, yeah, then we've got the needler. I know this one will get a lot of people excited and you can find the links to all of these in the description and the comments. I'm leaving links to all of them and ones including this will be an affiliate link. So if you purchase it, I get a little bit of dollar on the side so you can help out the channel. Yeah, lights up, $69 is just a great price. Down from $100 and I held this in my hand at, uh, at HCS and it is exceptional quality, very meaty and uh, the light up effect is just awesome. The needles as well. Super cool. Then we've got the Radar Wreckage. Now the Radar Wreckage is not a Black Friday deal, 
but it's on Amazon for $12.95, which um, usually, I mean, it retailed for $15, but it's steadily increased in price. Uh, it got to about $30, $40, back down to $13. I would definitely recommend picking this up. This is the best monkey, or one of the best monkeys we've ever got with that gorgeous jump pack. Uh, really worth $13, in my opinion. And the last one is this. This is technically not Halo, but it's called Halo View, and I just wanted to show it because it is on reduction for $35, and it, it, it's pretty pretty dang decent. I think, um, you know, they made this uh, this green color, uh, sage green, and I think they intentionally made it so it looked like a Master Chief one, so people, uh, people wanted to buy. Then we're on to the great land of Walmart. Uh, Walmart is a confusing website, man. Like, I don't like it at all. It's just secondary sellers, and it just it just leaves a bad taste in your mouth, man. Like, what what is that? Like, what is that image? <laughs> That's gross, dude. <laughs> like, what? You just took that and, like, gr oh, man, not good. Uh, Lights of Sun he lasts for 15 is, like, not the worst thing in the world. But, yeah, like, I, I don't like their whole business model here. It's very disingenuous to me. You never really know what's official and what's just secondhand. I don't, I don't really like it. But um, this, so i got to talk about this, the Warthog Rhydon, uh, $500. It is one of the, it's the greatest Halo collectible of all time. Uh, and I just had to put it in the video. It's, it's, it's free shipping. You, you give, it a, give it a chance. It's, it's amazing. Then we've got Banshee Breakout. Banshee Breakout was a classic set. Uh, not my favorite Banshee, but certainly a good one. And the Elite and, oh yeah, I mean, this uh, this recon is quite special actually. Uh, with that camo, uh, would recommend uh, picking this up for $21, reduced from 25, when I mean, it's a few years old, so it should be more than 25, but it's, uh, it's down to 21. So I would pick that up if you could. And ODST Hive Exterminator is finally available online, guys. Like, it's available online. It's, a, it's, it's here. So you got to pick up ODST Hive Exterminator if you can. $20, and you can, that, you can get that shipped to your house. Um, yeah, shipping is available. And no, my postcode is not 12345. <laughs> uh, someone said the, in a previous video, they were like, you left your postcode in. I was like, I don't think I did. Uh, so yeah, that's something you should pick up. This apparently is no internet. Oh, yeah. Three different websites have Halo Infinite for $20. It's it, it's tough to see, but you know, uh, Halo Infinite's only on the up and up from now on. Then we've got the uh, Infinite Collector's Edition, $35. Oh, oh yeah, no, I wanted to show you this because it's weird. It's the Infinite Collector's Edition, reduced from 150 to 35 but then when you click the one review, it says, this is not a collector's edition. It you It's a used copy of Halo, but it was left by Jimmy as in Jimmy Rings. Like, that's the Master Chief from the Halo TV show leaving a review dunking on Halo Infinite, so I wouldn't trust a word he says. But no, don't buy this, because $35, it's not gonna be the collector's edition. I don't think so. Then we got Target. We got a Master Chief retractable, retractable lanyard, only $5, which, you know, decent price. It's a, it's a nice lanyard. I've never seen that before, and I would like it now. Then we've got the Jumbo Pokeball. Now this is Mega Construct, so I wanted to include it, and it is a Black Black Friday deal, and it's only nineteen dollars. So I would definitely recommend picking that up. I'm very tempted. I, I can't really fit it in my suitcase, but very tempted for nineteen dollars. That is an exceptional price for the Pokeball. We got the Mantis down to thirty. Not the greatest reduction, but it is a really great Mantis. I mean, this thing, this thing is massive. Like I was, uh, let me tell you. I was so surprised as to how large this Mantis was when I got it. Like, this is a beefy boy. Shout out to Rodolfo for scoring that for me. Uh, but yeah, $30 is a decent price. Not the best, not the worst. Then we got the Halo Mythos, only $25. I have this book at home. It's a really good way to get your teeth stuck into the lore between Combat Evolved and Halo 5 and all the way through the Forerunner saga. Very good. Or the, the Forerunner trilogy of books. It's very interesting. Another Black Friday, $20, <laughs> Halo Infinite at uh, uh, Best Buy. Best Buy. Best Buy didn't really have much. I only wanted to show off this. It is a Black Friday deal. $50 for this PvP, PVC statue. Decent, decent. I mean, I, I would if I had the space. It is a nice statue, um, and I've seen it many times in Best Buy. I've always been tempted. Black Friday, $50. Not a huge reduction. I mean, $20, $20 is a decent reduction. Not bad. Uh, our last stop on our tour is GameStop. GameStop is a, a funny website as well. Uh, a, the, actually, the large majority of things, like this George is $12. It's not available for shipping, but 
some stars still stock it. So if you go on GameStop and you search Halo, you can. F it will take you a little bit of time. It's a bit painful, like you have to click on each one individually, see if it's in stock in your area, but some will be in stock in your area and sometimes you will find a George for $12. The ones that are in stock online are the brand new Spartan collection. Oh, another Halo Infinite series, <laughs> Series X, oh gosh, $20. Now, all of the new uh, Wave 6 of Spartan collection are reduced to $19 and they are shipping, and shipping is available, um, I think it's free shipping over $60. So we've got Carter, we got Linda, the Venator, and Master Chief Halo 5. And I just picked this one up yesterday. It is gorgeous. Uh, yeah, the last GameStop thing is the uh, Weapon F Funko Pop, $10. I also found this big monkey boy at GameStop two days ago, and he was $11. So, I mean, check your local GameStops. There's a lot of reductions right now. $10 for the weapon is awesome. And the last thing I found was Kroger, the Banshee Breakout. I, I know I mentioned the Banshee Breakout on Amazon. This is a cheaper price for $15, but it's only available shipping in a local Kroger area. We don't have Kroger in Minneapolis, unfortunately, so it's not available for us. So I hope you enjoyed that little Black Friday rundown. Check the links down below for all of the things I mentioned and happy shopping. If you buy anything with a affiliate link on Amazon, I get a few dollars, so that would help me out. But other than that, have a great day. You stay awesome, you stay safe out there, folks. And the domain with his mantis, big mantis boy, is signing off.